India's space diplomacy took a giant stride on Friday with the successful launch of the South Asia satellite, a gift to its neighbours that is aimed to provide the one and a half billion people of the region with better communication, weather forecasting, telemedicine and response to disaster management. Prime Minister Narendra Modi and leaders of six South Asian countries, Nepal, Bangladesh, Bhutan, Afghanistan, Maldives and Sri Lanka, came together via video conferencing to hail the launch of the communication satellite from Sri Harikota in Andhra Pradesh. All the leaders applauded as at 4.57 pm, the GSLV-509 rose into the sky from the second launch pad at the Satish Dhawan Space Center at Sri Harikota carrying the satellite. Pakistan had opted out, saying it has its own space program, forcing a change in the name from SARC Satellite to South Asia Satellite. In 2014, Prime Minister Narendra Modi tasked the Indian Space Research Organization to develop a satellite for use by the SARC countries. Costing around Rs 235 crore, the satellite has a lifespan of over 12 years and its objective is to provide communication application in KU band for the user nations. Bangladesh Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina, Afghan President Ashraf Ghani, Bhutanese Prime Minister Shering Tobge, Nepal Prime Minister Pushpa Kamal Dahal and Sri Lankan President Maitri Pal Sirisena congratulated the initiative, saying it would usher in a new era of regional cooperation. Sabka Saath, Sabka Vikas, Maldives President Abula Yamin said, terming the launch an example of India's neighbourhood first policy. Modi said the South Asia satellite would go a long way in addressing the region's economic and developmental priorities. He said, I also deeply appreciate the strong and valuable support extended by your governments without which this project would not have been possible. Our coming together is a sign of our unshakable resolve to place the needs of our peoples in the forefront. INS Report.